Hi guys, it's Amir from Newbie and Me. I am excited to introduce to you the new Vinici Tinum. This product is, should be with us by June. Uh, it looks absolutely amazing. It pushes great and the features a 10 out of 10. Vinici, you've done an amazing job with this. Uh, and I'm gonna go through some of those with you. Starting off with the carry cut. So, looking at the style of this, the apron has got a nice stitch pattern at the front. The detailing obviously on the apron there with the Vinici logo looks really cool. Don't forget this is a prototype. They are gonna improve this even further than what it looks like at the minute. Um, going on to the actual hood, they've got a nice secret pocket here, obviously for your handle to pick up. Going on to the actual zip here, which will extend your hood, which again, on most carry cots, it doesn't have, but Vinici have kept this from the previous uh, model. So you can extend it even further, which I think is fantastic. And again, going back to the actual hood, um, if you pull this up, you can see that it's got a nice ventilated mesh, which will allow airflow to your baby. So dropping the hood back, I'm gonna unzip this for you. Um, looking inside the actual carry cot, it looks nice, soft, uh, cushioned, um, which is going to be adding a lot of warmth and comfort to your child. The one thing I really like is how thick this mattress. This is actually one of the thickest mattresses uh, that I've ever seen. Um, so it's going to add a lot of comfort to your child. There is slight holes in the carry cot. They've not confirmed whether it is an occasional sl overnight sleeper yet, um, but that is going to be confirmed soon. Um, not only that, uh, with this carry cot, it is from birth to roughly six months again. Um, and yeah, a great carry cot and it's easy to take off as well. All you need to do is push it from either side, pull it up again from the handle. Very light, easy to do, and it has got studs underneath, which will not scrape your carry cot. So coming on to the basket, it has got a nice big basket inside. Again, we don't know the weight of it just as yet, but I think in about five kg, it is reinforced from the bottom, so it will add a lot of strength. Uh, the other cool thing about this as well, the same example, if you, you are putting something that's quite long or doesn't fit, you can extend it, by opening this, which will allow you to push something through. Um, so that really helps. Going obviously from the back, it has got a break in the center, which is quite easy to use. And looking at these wheels, the one thing that I really like about it is the fact that this has got like a, a strip here where only this will touch the actual floor. What that will enable you to do is push and glide your push chair a lot easier on surfaces, because if the whole of the surface of the wheel was touching the floor, it just means it's heavier to push. Going on to the actual handle, you can extend it higher if you wanted to for those tall people. And obviously if you wanted to go all the way lower, you can do as well. Um, but overall, it's got a four way suspension, easy to push uh, and a great product so far. With the Vinici Tinum, you're gonna get two chassis colors, one being chrome and the other one being a dark gunmetal chassis color. You're also gonna get four different fabric colors. So there is great choice with Vinici Tinum. The other thing as well is the seat unit. The seat unit is roughly from six months to roughly three to three and a half years old, but they are gonna look at seeing if you can use the seat unit from birth because the way it lies down, which I'm gonna show you in a minute. So they kept one feature, which was a, a massive selling point for us uh, with the, the older Vinici model, which they brought across, and that is the extended hood. So with that extended hood, it'll stop obviously sunlight getting to your child, it'll protect them uh, and it'll help them go to sleep uh, blocking out any shade getting to them. Dropping that hood back again, the seat unit itself is nice and large. You have got a bumper bar and you've got this divider in the middle just to separate the legs, make it easy for them. And you have got a footrest, so as they get bigger, you can extend that if you wanted to as well. This seat unit is currently forward facing, but we're gonna have it wheel facing for the next bit. And that's how easy it is to switch it around. And it is memory buttons as well to take the seat unit off. So dropping the seat unit back, as you can see, it does quite, uh, it does lie quite flat. Um, so that's what we're gonna question later on, whether they can use it from birth. Coming around here, I'm gonna show you this uh, changing bag. The changing bag got nice detailing on as well. So it is all nice and stitched there and you've got the Vinici emblem there, which is really upmarket uh, and classy. From the size of the changing bag, you have got the hooks to attach it to your pram. And that's again, another big feature that they've kept that a lot of our parents love about this pram. With the Vinici Tinum, you can put universal car seat adapters on the frame, uh, which will allow you to put the Vinici car seat onto it, as well as the Max Cozy as well. Um, but with this uh, pram, you can actually fold it 
uh, with the seat units on. So you can fold it world facing as well as parent facing. I'm going to demonstrate this to you now. So you drop the hood back, pull the bottom bit up, and literally fold it forward with the middle bit at the bottom. Drop, make sure the handle is dropped down, and there you have it. Dead easy to do, and you have got a handle, and you have got again a strap to put it over. It is going to be slightly heavier than not having the seat unit on, um, but in terms of the way it looks in a boot, that's how small it will look in a boot. You can make it even smaller by taking the wheels off, but personally, I think that's really really good in terms of the size of it and it'll fit in most boots taking it pulling it back up dead straight forward there we have it and you drop the hood back and you're ready to go thank you for watching any more questions just drop us a message or give us a call and we'd be able to answer them for you thank you